Okay, now I've got the uh, painted up. I've got this in black. Now, what I did is you can go down to the dollar store and you can get some little Bibles like this, like for a dollar. Okay? Just like that. They're, 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 I don't know how in the world anybody can read them anyway. They're so small. The print is so small and stuff. Very, very cheap. And so what I did was I measured the uh, width and the length on the little Bible, and I cut the little verses to fit that, just like that, in other words. See what I'm doing? Now, I'm going to take a little super glue, put it there, 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 well, there, 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 there. there. There, there, and maybe a few drops along in here. And I'm going to take my little verse, I'm going to stick it in there, and I'm going to stick it on a little thing like that, and hold it. And there it goes. It sticks like that. Now you're going to have a little bit of, of uh, bleed through in there, no matter what. Even if you used white white uh, glue, you're going to have a little bleed through on it. Now if you get a little long, you can trim it off. And then when you spray it, it will be... Now this is uh, this here. Is a little bit long, so I'm going to take a little bit off of here. Just like that. Once again, let me go here. 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 Here, 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 a little bit in here. And I'm going to do the same thing. And like I said, you're going to have a little bleed through no matter what. Let me come up. Wait, let's, let me get my, I'm sorry, my eyesight is so, so bad. It's hard for me to see sometimes when I'm doing something this small. Okay. There we go. When it's like this, And you just sort of glue the scriptures on like that. Now, I don't know if white glue would be, uh, I tell you, you could use contact glue or whatever. I just use a little, and it does bleed through with the um, super glue. But we could just say it's an old worn Bible. Like that. And then we're going to spray it. Yeah, maybe contact cement or something. Super glue is all I had, in other words. Maybe some contact cement or uh, I don't know what glue would not bleed through. Uh, perhaps white glue might not bleed through. But uh, I would say it probably would. And you take your uh, the black, if you have any showing, 
with a small brush. When you get it on there, and you just follow that along in there. Now I'm sure a lot of you might have other ideas. Uh, perhaps maybe a white glue would not bleed through as much. but I don't have a lot of time right now. And I'm gonna spray it with a with a, a uh, acrylic. There's an old Warren Bible. There's a little place in here. Uh, didn't quite Okay, I'm going to just put a little bit in there. And just go down like that. And, like I said, a lot of you, this is the first time I've ever done this, so uh, I would have to experiment with the different types of, uh, of uh, different types of uh, glues to see which one would not bleed through at all. But you've got the general idea, in other words. And when I spray it, it's gonna, it's gonna turn, it's probably gonna not even show very much, and once it dries as well. But you've got the general idea of what I'm trying to do here. And I know you, a lot of you are a lot better painters than I am, so I know you can do a whole lot better job as far as um, this is concerned. But you have the general idea about what we have here. And um, put a little bit in there just to put that down like that. And there you go, just like that. Now, like I said, I'm, I'm using super glue because that's all I had, but you probably can find some glues that won't bleed through or some contact cement or something like that that won't bleed through like that. And uh, um, I think once I spray it though, it's not gonna be as noticeable um, into that, but you've got the general idea of what this is all about. And that is our little soap Bible, in other words. And like I said, I'm, I'm, I think white glue probably would not, uh, if these pages are so thin, um, you know, let me know if you find the right glue. Um, but like I said, I'm gonna spray it anyway. I'm gonna darken this anyway with the, um, with the deft or the acrylic so it's probably going to blend in pretty good whenever I get through with it. But anyway, there is just a little way that you can make a little soap Bible and uh, give it to your friends or whatever. And like I said, um, I didn't know if this super glue was going to bleed through, but it did. Spotted the Bible a little bit. You can just say it's, but I think once I spray it with the acrylic and stuff, it's going to change the colors anyway as it goes okay well god bless you now and uh um I'll, actually this would be even pretty if you painted this a blue color in the back and uh because it's sort of the the color that you uh, uh but i that was just some paints i had ready and everything like that but anyway there is your little Bible and uh, like I said once I spray it I think it's going to take on a little bit better better tone because it's going to darken 
the, um, the letters in here. Okay. Well, God bless you now. Thank you very much. And uh, uh, that's our little soap bible. Okay.